Cherokee. Hey, this one says Summit Point. Sweet. All right, Chris, you gonna knock out today's driving? We'll see. Like you're up. I did my part. I did the hard part. I did the fun part. The hard, yeah. I did the fun part. You can do something. Nah, we're so far ahead. I can't lose that many points. <laughs> Morning, boys. How you doing? Big Chris Smith, Todd Hello. Treffert. Just checking it out, catching some rays. Got the sun today. Everyone's here. Everyone's unpacked. Sounds like everyone's transit went very smooth. ZR1, Tom and Steve right here. Andy's here. It sounds like the McLaren's doing okay. Morning. Saw, morning. Doing, I'm doing great. How's the car? Yeah, pretty rock solid, it sounds like. So far. Really having fun? He is. You know, we've done this before in 2011, so we figured it's been 10 years. Let's go out and have some more fun and try it in a car that he helped build. So if we don't do well, I have somebody to blame. That's right. Yeah, if this thing, you know, can't do it, it's Billy only has himself to blame. This is true. So if you don't know, uh, on these GT500s, uh, Billy was the development driver. For them. Was the development driver, uh, the shift points in it in track mode, the, lot, the suspension, the whole nine yards are his. So he can't say it wasn't set up right, because he set it up. Yep, so we'll catch up with Billy a little later. Beautiful morning out here. Morning, sir. How you doing? Pretty good. I heard uh, Abram had you on for a while last night on the slip angle. Yeah, we uh... We like three days worth to catch up on because of uh, just some, yeah, you know, the weather and yep. some drama and stuff like that. So it's cool. No, it's fun to listen to. Ooh, got some Starbucks, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Never had one before. Pretty good. Telltale. It's his birthday, kid. Yeah. Is your birthday? Today's my birthday. Hey, happy birthday. That's awesome. The one lap is always my birthday present to myself. <laughs> well, happy cool. birthday to myself. Happy birthday to you, Tom. Ready to rock? I'm ready. You been here a hundred times? Today, no, I've been here once, but in this car a month ago. Cool. All right, nine tenths, cruise around. All right, fine. Ten point five. <laughs> nine point nine nine nine. There you go. All right, it is time. Chris is gonna get strapped in. Go get us our three laps. And lunch time. You got your Barry White clip queued up? Yeah, actually, I got a, I got something a little, little uh, more Southern pride. A little Southern pride. A little Southern pride. All right, should be all set. Ready to rock. All right, rivalry we're all here to see. They're like the same thing, it's just one's got an extra like four liters. It's got two more engines than we do. <laughs> and we're off. Most nervous I've ever been for someone else's car. You nervous for me? Oh, I thought you were Who else? Alright, that is three laps in for the leaders. Car calm down. It's coming, it's coming Okay, down. go relax it for a few like minutes. Stop completely. It has to be Chris is on track now. There's Chris. Across the line, that's three laps. <laughs> and Hollis. Still running, still going good. Awesome. All right, that's the top 10 in. Let's see if we can find efficient timing and scoring. Weird, so. That looked good, that so looked good. Lap one, or out lap, car felt pretty good. Lap one, the back end started just sliding all over the place. Laps two and three, I don't know if I just adapted to it yeah. or what, but it was better. He looked the quickest out there out of our group. I did a, the last lap was an 18.9. I have no idea if that's good or not. How'd it go? Uh, I made a few mistakes. I kind of got it all put together on lap three, I think. Started really coming together, but. It looked like you were pushing it. What's your quick time? It was a 118. 118 what? Ooh, it's a battle now. 118.2. Oh, what'd you get? 18.2. Yeah, I had an 18.9 on my last lap. I had a 19.2 and an 18.9. Tom, get fourth. Tom get fourth. 55.7, that's fastest. Super K, 57.3. So Tom, Billy, Todd, Andy, 
then Chris. Oh, Anthony. Ooh, Anthony snuck Anthony, in there. Then, then Chris. And then I think I'm And next. then you. Yeah. Ooh, it's tight. Yeah, it's intense. That's how to go it's awesome. Yeah, it's good. It's good. All right, well, cool. Everyone's in the hunt and super close up top. But because it's so close, no big shakeups to this session. So next is lunch and then uh, do this one more time. This thing is amazing. <laughs> What's just doing Keith, right? thanks for bringing your Subaru out. Yeah, man, it's good seeing you guys. Yeah. Some extra cylinders in there. Yes. <laughs> Dude, what a unit. Of your old tires. I like it. I kind of want one. So you did all this? All of it. 900 bucks on Craigslist. Oh my god. I've done every modification to it. You don't even need a jack to work on it. <laughs> and then we're just to prove that what we did works, so to yeah. speak. Yeah. Is this your first one lap? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I mean, I'd say the... You've done everything else now, so... Y yeah, I, <laughs> yeah. The highlights, I'd say, of this thing are the people part of it. That's the best That's the... Right. It's not an yeah. charge. That's yep. why we can. So obviously you have tons of tons of racing experience and all kinds of experience. Can you tell me a little bit about uh, some of the highlights of your racing career? Highlights? Well, I don't have, I don't have any. <laughs> uh, you know, winning Daytona 24, that yep. was... Uh, yeah, that's pretty special. That's huge. Um, you know, I, yeah, I drove Indy cars and drove in IMSA for a bunch of years and that kind of stuff. That's really cool. But the yes. coaching stuff, you know, I've had drivers that I've coached win things and get the same level of thrill out of that that I have. You know, yeah, you win I, the Rolex or you get a driver that, are, that you've brought in and they win the Rolex and you go, I don't know which is better. So I love both of those things. So. That's cool. Yep. So it sounds like you're a, a true racing enthusiast yeah uh, i mean I'm, and, and i love every form of, of motorsport yeah you know i've worked with guys in drifting and drag racing and motorcycles and all sorts of different things and to me it's it's just it's got a motor and some tires that, that's that's cool this event is I, you know i sort of came here thinking i'm just going to have some fun learn a lot yep. meet some cool people have a great experience but after the first day, I'm thinking, i got to come back and win this thing. So oh, Cool. Yeah. So you run a, a podcast, huh? Yeah, Speed Seeking Podcast. Uh, I've been doing it. I've taken a couple of breaks, which I'm kind of starting to do a little bit of a break here. Sure. There. But, uh, um, yeah, it's in almost 200 episodes. And really? Yeah. It's, it's Very cool. Uh, I, you know, I tell people, honestly, it's a selfish thing. Because I get to have conversations with really cool <laughs> car driver, you know, car people driving. So that that to me is uh, that's that's the reason I do it. Well, very cool. So I'm sure to uh, check out some of those Speed Secret podcasts. Yeah. And I guess we'll keep going. Ross Bentley, pretty cool, awesome guy. Love to uh, catch up with him some more. What's up, Chris? How you doing, buddy? Any issues? Me. Uh -oh. I left the uh, I left the oil still out. Like it was a pump system. I did it pushed oil still out. Yeah. So we gotta dump them out. It wasn't it was just this side. That side, the passenger side was dry. We had to charge pipe off at the lowest point. Yeah. There's nothing in it. Okay. So, so uh, just this turbo was the weaker link, I guess. Sure. Right here. <laughs> right here. <laughs> we Looks like it went well. Too, so. Awesome. It's only be one better. <laughs> That's right. Ooh, I see you have a modified flap now. We do. Hybrid flap. Hopefully this will be the balance we're looking for. You get hot out there? Tires? No, they're cold. <laughs> we have cup twos on, so we want it to be oh, hot. Oh, that's right. So everybody else overheats their tires. That's right. Yeah. Yeah, what else? So far this event, that hasn't been helping us. <laughs> <laughs> Look at those happy faces. Ooh, so happy. It's tightening up. Do you? Yeah. Well, you don't need to be pushing anything. Just drive around. Yep. Same thing, one more time. Lunch time. <laughs> Would you hear about what happened today? No. The car wouldn't start on grid. Oh my gosh, no. really? I'm sitting there and my group is going out on the recon and I'm hitting the button and nothing's going on and it says key not found. So the group made the whole recon lap and I'm just punching the buttons and stuff and eventually it fires up as they're sitting at the line. So I go up and I ask Brocker, I say, can I go with no recon? He says, sure, how about it? Cold tires on the line, wheel spin. So he just pulled out and went straight. And sent it. 
no, cold breaks, cold right. everything. I go oh into the first turn. I'm like, I don't know what Good to do here. here. <laughs> I'll be a little conservative. A little conservative, and, just for one corner. And by then, and then just went on autopilot since and uh, finished P4 out of that whole ordeal. I know. I like, wow, I'll take that. So P. Uh, Three yesterday? Uh, at the at afternoon. The circle track. Yeah, at the circle track. The circle track. You got me. It, it, I did. I yeah. Did. Still leading the class. Still holding you're, on to a P5 overall, which is kind of our goal. Uh, uh, well, your wounded's been pretty strong the last two well, sessions. Thanks. So. It, it, a three and a four? It's <laughs> awesome. Well, we're all just glad you're back up and running. Yeah, well, so. thanks. I appreciate it. I mean, we are too. Uh, cool. There. Thanks. See you. Good job. All right. Well, sounds like we're wrapping up lunch. And we gotta get this car fired back up. I gotta find Chris. Everyone's getting ready. Good job, buddy. <laughs> At least the truck's a lot closer. <laughs> All right, here we go. Kind of know what I'm supposed to do. Try not to mess it up. Nice job. Look quick. Fifth, going down the straightaway on the second lap and had a whole lot more speed coming into turn one, so I kind of blew it a little bit. But not bad. It was like, <laughs> ooh, I'm going a lot faster. Alright, back on the road. you guys have the full experience so went all the way to the hotel tonight uh, here's the route and we've basically gone full circuit so gone from summit point and just made the trip up here to gingerman so that little drive there to gingerman we just completed was 614 miles 
So results for the afternoon session. So Tomo did take the top spot. But Andy Hollis had an awesome run in the McLaren. So he's P2. Then Super K. And we are down here in 7th. I'll leave a link to these results in the description. Overall, no shakeups. All right, that's going to do it for today. Uh, I'm pretty beat, so I'm going to get this edited and get it up to you guys. Thanks again, everyone that watches this. Please like and subscribe. We'll see you in the morning. Yeah.